Well, good morning, everybody, and welcome. For those of you that don't know me, my name is Eddie Freeman. I'm speaking to you live this morning from Boston, Massachusetts, and I want to welcome each and every one of you to our live training call. Hope you guys had a great Halloween with the kids. It is now November 2nd, and, uh, man, we are no longer in beta. We are officially launched. Woke up this morning, and it was 32 degrees out. It was fun seeing all the frost on the cars out front, (laughs) and it won't be long. So before I get started on today's call, uh, real quickly, uh, I'm going to be in Arkansas and Texas on November, Monday, November 18th, Tuesday, November 19th, and I will get you the details shortly, but I think I'm going to be right around Little Rock, Arkansas, and I'm going to be around Dallas, Texas. So I'll get the, we'll have the flyers out, and all that information is coming soon. So I want to get right to the call today. And, you know, it's funny, <clears throat> I, uh, I don't work with notes, ever. And when I do interviews with people, I don't have notes. I don't tell them what I'm going to ask in advance, uh, vice versa. And there's a reason for that. And I've spoken, uh, literally, in front of over 3,000 people before. I've been translated into many different languages over the years. And people say, you know why? Because we want to speak from the heart. And so when you hear from us today, you're going to hear a couple of guys talking to you from the heart and what we truly believe. And so if you looked at the topic for today, I want to start with why affiliate marketing? Why would anybody want to be in network marketing, affiliate marketing, direct sales? You know, it's, <clears throat> it's so funny. When I started in the industry of network marketing 29 years ago, um, and it's, this may will be 30 years I've been in this industry, people thought, oh, man, this is some kind of an illegal pyramid scheme. Did you guys ever hear that? Oh, you guys are part of an illegal pyramid scheme. And it's so funny. You know, I hear it less and less. As a matter of fact, I almost never hear it anymore because the truth of the matter is almost everybody uh, knows somebody that has done very well in network marketing over the years. And if you ever run across this and people say, well, you know, you're in one of those little illegal pyramid deals, I would say to them, I know exactly what you're saying. I used to think that. I really did. I always thought that network marketing was an illegal pyramid scheme, and then somebody brought it to my attention. Do you know that there are many um, publicly traded network marketing companies right now? Amway and New Skin and Herbalife's and... I guess my question is, how are you ever going to get through uh, the Security and Exchange Commission and go through everything that they go to and become public if you're an illegal pyramid scheme? So it's, let's throw that one right out the books. <clears throat> but why do you need affiliate marketing? Why do we need it? Uh, to me, it's, it's pretty clear. You see, it's very difficult to live the American dream today. Mm, why is that? Well, I believe it's because when we were young, when we were kids, we were given some misinformation by people that love us. And we believed it because it was told to us by our our teachers, our parents. What they said, hey, you know what? If you want to live the American dream, just go go to school. Get a great education, come out, get a job, and then your employer will pay you money. Well, what's what's wrong with that? Well... For your employer, he wants to live the American dream as well. And in order for that person to maximize their benefits, they need to minimize yours. And so every day you go out and trade a unit of time for a unit of money. And what you're going to find, there are not enough units of time during the course of the day to make that exchange often enough to create wealth. And unless you were blessed uh, athletically and you're going to become a professional athlete or you're going to be a movie star or write songs and perform if you're a performer, if that's not in the cards for you as it wasn't for me, and if you look at how wealth is created, and don't tell me uh, a doctor is wealthy, you just go to school for seven years, a lawyer is wealthy. Let me tell you something about a, a, a doctor, physician. You know, the average physician today makes uh, a very small six-figure year income. Now, that's comfortable, but is it wealth? Is it wealth? 
And the only way for the doctor to make more money is to see more clients, which then decreases his quality of life. See, if you really look at how wealth is created, it's by people that are own their own business. But as a person that has owned his own business and has looked into owning many others, I can tell you right now it's not as easy as it sounds. Why? Because it costs so much money to open up your own business. You're looking at six figures or seven figures to get started. And, you know, what's funny is most people don't have that kind of money. So you go to the bank and borrow against your assets. Well, if you fail, as the U.S. Census Bureau tells us that over 60% of new businesses will within the first five years, I promise you the bank is not going to come over to you and say, uh, hey, Janice, you had a good shot at it. Good luck to you in the future. They're going to say, hey, Janice, make a list of your possessions because we're going to want some of those. See, in affiliate marketing, network marketing, you can get started, I mean, in our company, you can get started for under $500. And what's funny is when I opened up my jewelry store way back when, it was uh, six figures to get started, six figures. And uh, I had to bust my hump for 60, 70, 80 hours a week. If it had snowed between December 20th and December 24th, as it is off to do here in Massachusetts, oh, my gosh, it would have been horrifying. I busted it for two years to break even. I got started in affiliate marketing and just this company alone for less than $500. And my first check came, and I had already made my money back and showed a profit. And it's not just me. There are many of you on this phone that have received your investment back initially within your very first week and certainly within your first month rather than your first two years. The other thing about affiliate marketing that is very strong for me, it's not how much money you earn. It's the quality of income. You see, when I had my jewelry store, my day-to-day efforts were everything in how much money I made. Because if I wasn't in that jewelry store, nobody could sell the big-ticket item. Well, once I made it in the industry of network marketing, affiliate marketing, my day-to-day efforts were no longer important to the generation of my income. Because once you make it, it's residual income. See, it's the quality of income. And listen, I'm not saying that your first two years in your business in network marketing, affiliate marketing, that it isn't going to take time. It is. But once you make it, there's something about residual income. I'll never forget years ago, I was in Hawaii. And I had been there sitting out, you know, by the pool, which is right on the beach. And it was like my fourth day there, and I made friends with this guy that was a plastic surgeon. And I'll never forget, he said to me, well, one day, this was like our third or fourth day out there. He says, well, Eddie, another day, but sadly, not another dollar. And I said to him, well, Doc, you're wrong, because for me, it's another day and another $2,645.82. And he said, how can that be? And I said, it's all about residual income. You really need to look into it. See, there's a lot. And if people tell you they have any questions about affiliate marketing, I just ask them, just curious. Um, Do you own a home or, or rent? Okay. Uh, do you own an automobile or, or rent? Do you have payments, monthly payments? Well, what that says to me is you're spending money 24 hours a day, seven days a week. The clock is ticking on you, okay? Are you making money 24 hours a day, seven days a week? No? Well, how can you ever get ahead in that equation? See, when you put it all together, you're going to see that – our business model uh, of, of affiliate marketing flat out works. But <clears throat> as you're looking, because we're not the only network marketing company, affiliate marketing company, so now what we're going to do is I'm going to take a few minutes and explain to you why Envy and why our business model from a business standpoint. And then I've got a very special person on the call to explain why Envy in regards to our product. So why Envy as far as a business model? For those of you that have been in the industry of network marketing, there's part of the business model that we all love. 
And that business model is simple. You find a product that you like, and you share it with people. Just like if you went to a good restaurant, you tell people to go there. You, you read a good book, you tell people to read it. But the, the owner of the restaurant, the author of the book, they don't send you a residual check because you referred a friend of yours to it. They just don't. And so that part of the business model is so nice. You know, you refer five or ten of your friends, and now you make residual income on what you would have done for free. But then what happens is they refer their friends and associates who refer their friends and associates who refer their friends and associates. And the next thing you know, as long as they stay on a product, you've got residual income for a long time to come. See, that part of the business model is so strong. But what part is not? If the business model was that strong, why don't more people, why is it only a select few that seem to rise to the top. You know, I believe there's a reason for that. You know, I've always been in health and wellness. 29 years I'm in network marketing, been affiliated with four network marketing companies, and have been what what most people would consider extremely ex- uh, successful in all four of those companies. They were always health and wellness companies. And you know what? I've only represented good products my whole life including today. I would only represent what I feel is a real good product. Yet no matter how good my product was, people were getting off the product after about three months. And as I spoke to other of my friends that were leaders in the industry, the same thing was true. People get on a product, they have great results, but within 90 days they're off the product and I didn't quite understand it. Well, then somebody showed me an article that was put out by uh, the DSA, Direct to Sales Association, and they confirmed what I said, what I was told. The average person in MLM affiliate marketing stays on the product for 90 days. Well, how can you build that strong residual income if that happens? And I said, well, why? Why does that happen? Well, it took me a while of research to finally figure it out. And once I did, it made so much sense. If you've been in network marketing before and you've been with a product, okay, you're priced out of the game after 90 days. And here's what I mean. So to, you're, you're participating in a network marketing company's compensation plan, and in order to be active and receive a check, you need to have a personal volume, an auto ship of 100, not $100, 100 points of volume. Well, every network marketing company I've looked at, it's never dollar for dollar. I mean, my last network marketing company, in order to get 100 points of volume, I needed to spend 160 real dollars, and that's before shipping and taxes. So let's think about this. At the end of three months, I've spent over $480. Most people don't make a lot of money in their first three months in network marketing, And they say, you know what, at this rate, I'm going to be bankrupt. Uh, Therefore, they stop using the product and quit the business. What about our business model? At the end of three months, have you spent $480? Nope. Do you know in almost every single case, at the end of three months, not only have you not spent $480, but you've saved money. You've saved money on the product because if you're normally spending $120 a month for cable and now you're spending $59 and $97 a month, half that price for what we have to offer, it only makes sense. When you couple that with our compensation structure that I believe is the strongest in the industry, and it will bear out as you see where the checks are going to go in this company within a year, two years, three years. I believe we've got the potential to have the largest check to money coming into the company ratio ever because we pay out real dollars. While some network marketing companies are paying out 
Oh, oh yeah, I know they tell you they pay out 55%, but that's on the BV. It's really 35%. Most network marketing companies are paying out less than 40%. Uh, to this point in time, we've paid out over 60 And the way I see it, we will always be paying out over 55% of real dollars spent. And our compensation plan has got something for those of you that are part-time people, uh, that are very part-time, that are brand new to the industry. For the first time ever, I see an easy place where a person that has got very little MLM experience, an 18-year-old kid, my next-door neighbor, 18-year-old kid, could have shown me Envy TV, and I would have enrolled because I love the business model. I love the product. In any other network marketing company, that kid's going to make almost no money on me. If it's a binary compensation plant, I'm going to be a strong leg, and I built an organization of 25,000 people. He makes nothing. If this is a breakaway, well, yeah, I'm going to be his big power leg, but in order for him to capitalize on my 25,000 people, he's going to have to find 12 more, 11 more to get 12 wide. But in this one, to make money on, on 25, let's see, if I build an organization of 25,000 people and this young man can make $2 a person, well, that's $50,000 a month. And does he have to jump through hoops to get it? No, he's got to be on the service spending $59.97 a month and find six people anywhere in the world to be on the service spending the same. And there it is. You've got it. So I hope I've covered why affiliate marketing, from a business point, why envy. But now what I'd like to do to simply talk about today, nothing more than envy the product and what it means to you uh, we're pretty fortunate on this call to have, and uh, I know after speaking with Clayton yesterday, you're going to be hearing less and less <laughs> as most of the hard work is done. But I wanted to get him on this call you know, one more time now because nobody can really explain the Envy product better. So with that, I'm going to turn the call over to our CEO, our founder, he's over in Southern California. Good morning, Clayton. Good morning, Eddie. How are you today? I'm unbelievable. How are you? On top of the roll, sir. Thank you for asking. So, but I just I'm going to ask you one question, and then I'm going to be done here. What What do you see? Why Envy? And as far as a product, what What do you see in Envy? And what was your dream in this particular product? Well, Eddie, it's interesting now because a lot of things are coming to light in the next um, – in fact, one of um, our affiliates sent me a Facebook message this morning saying, oh, I understand now why Apple is acting so funny with your app. Um, a lot of things are coming to light that people may not have known that's coming, but it, it sure works out as the time goes on. People understand more and more. And why Envy as a product? The streaming industry – is going to be so huge. Apple just announced today or later on yesterday that they are coming up with their new Apple Plus service, which is a streaming service, for $4.99 a month. Now, some of you may think, oh, that's our competition. Oh, that's going to be tough. But no, it's not going to be tough because right behind them, Disney Plus is coming out in the next two months with their service. And it's, they're going to go after companies like Hulu and Sling because everyone's jumping into this game because we want to disrupt an in- industry that people are paying too much for. Just like back in the days when we used to pay long-distance phone calls and we had a phone bill of $300, $400, $500 a month, today we no longer have those long-distance phone calls because technology and the world has changed. So the same thing's going to happen with, with streaming. Streaming is changing the cable, changing the, the way of people thinking of watching television, the pay-per-views that you used to pay $100 for a fight or $80 for a fight. Now they're offering it for four ninety nine a month, and you get all the fights. So why Envy? What Envy is, basically, and this is where I think a lot of people are misunderstanding, Envy is not the full solution to your TV viewing. Envy is one of the solutions to your TV viewing. So, for example, 
Apple, Pay, I mean, Apple Plus is coming out here very shortly, and they're going to have their streaming movies. They're going to compete against companies like Hulu and Netflix and things like that. Well, great, they have that. Well, Envy does not have streaming movies. Envy is a live TV service that offers things that the other companies don't offer. So there's no company on the planet right now that offers everything that you need, just like anything in life. We don't have one place that we go to get everything you need. You can go to Amazon, and Amazon will give you a plethora of things that you need. Well, Envy is no different. We're showing people that if you go to um, your Fire Stick, you can watch stuff in Envy. Tonight, the fight's there, so you're going to watch the fight. If you want to watch a movie, you can go over to Apple+. Plus. You can go to NBA, to um, Stars Network. You can go to um, Netflix. You can all these different things. And I think that's where people are misunderstanding. And um, they don't understand there's a full movement in the industry of television. And it's now the streaming industry. So, for example, I was watching um, football last year um, before the Super Bowl. This is before NBA launched. And I was watching a playoff game on NBC app on my Amazon because I refuse to use DirecTV at 200 something dollars a month. I'm just not going to do it. So I'm watching this football game on Amazon, um, Fire Stick, and it buffered, and it stopped, and it froze. So in that case, I can now switch over to something else that works and watch it there, because the streaming industry is not a perfect industry. It's going to get better as it goes. And now that Apple has joined, and Disney is joining, all the technology is going to get better and better, which is going to give us a better leverage to get to the next level. So streaming is just going to get better and better as we go. I remember back in the day where everywhere I went, my phone, my phone will drop, my cell phone will drop. Well, today it doesn't drop that much. It still drops once in a while, but compared to five years ago, it dropped all the time. So those are the things that's coming. So I wanted people to understand that NV is, again, one of the solutions to watch television, and it takes you to that level where you can watch it on, for example, if you're watching the game on NFL Network, you can watch it on NFL Network, you can watch it on Envy, you can watch it. Uh, in fact, I saw the, um, the football game on Thursday was broadcast on three different platforms. So Envy is one of the platforms. Amazon Prime is a platform. Um, Netflix will be a platform. No, I'm sorry, Hulu will be a platform. So there are different places to get it. What I really thing that separates Envy from everyone else, and this is the key to Envy, and I'll turn the call back to you, and I know we don't have um, a Ask the Tech call anymore, so I'll kind of give you this little information. This is the real key to Envy, and this is why Envy exists. All these services and all the things that you talked about prior to me speaking on this call today about people having a position that they can make more money, and if they're on vacation, they're not a surgeon, all the things you said are so perfect and right on. This is why Envy, because now what Envy does, it gives you a solution, a solution to watch programming in a different way than you've ever seen before, and there's really no other company who you can't watch the 24-7 the, um, the broadcast on. There are certain things that we have that you can't do. I can't watch on Envy 2B TV. 2B TV is a free service that gets a lot of movies, but here's where we separate ourselves from everyone else. As people get into streaming, they're going to tell their friends and family, just like we tell our friends and family on Facebook or Instagram, have you tried this new app? Have you done this? And all these companies grow and make billions of dollars because we are telling our friends and family. Not one of those companies, not Facebook, not Instagram, not DirecTV, not um, any of these companies sit there and say, you know what, we'll like to share the funds with the people that helped us build a company. I just don't see it. And when I started the thought of Envy, I went, you know, we want to be different. We want to do something. So Amazon, you, I mean, they allow you to make some commissions. It's not residual like you talked about. Um, Netflix, they will get, may give you a referral fee, but no one's giving you a monthly income that you can refer six people to Envy and now your service is free. If you decided, you know what, those six were pretty easy. Let me refer 10 more. Now you've referred 16. Now you're making $160 a month. You can take that extra money, $100, and now you can purchase um, Netflix. You can purchase Apple Plus TV. You can purchase Disney Plus TV. So now who's paying for those services? Envy is paying for those services. 
And if you decided that you really like the product and really understand how it works, and you start building a team of like-minded people to do it, and all of a sudden, instead of paying $100 extra for those products out of Envy, which Envy's paying for it now, now you can make a car payment. Now you can make a mortgage payment. Now you have enough residual income that you can retire a spouse. Now you can now take people, um, take your, send your children to a better school. It keeps growing. Now you're able to maybe leave your job as it grows. So that's really why Envy. I mean, to me, that's what it comes down to. Envy has created something different than any other company out there. All, I mean, the reason Apple TV is coming out, Apple Plus is coming out in the next day or so to a four ninety nine. They want to capture hundreds of millions of people, paying them four ninety nine, so they can make more money for their stockholders. I have not seen where Apple has said, "Refer your friends, and we'll give you twenty five cents out of that four ninety nine." They won't because it goes to their stockholders. It goes to you can go buy Apple stock and get a piece of it, but you're not going to get a piece of it like you do with Envy. And that's the difference between Envy and any other company. So there you have it. Oh, Clayton, thank you so much. I, I appreciate that. That was so well said. And uh, guys, uh, I just want, uh, I hope, I hope that between Clayton and myself today, we've pushed the button in one of you. We've made the, all of a sudden the the lights have gone off and you realize what you've got in your hands, because I believe that what what we have here, what we have created uh, long term, is going to be just. It's not going to be an opportunity for everybody, but I believe that those of you that grasp what Clayton just said, what I had talked about earlier, you're going to run at this opportunity, because in my 29 years in the industry, I've never heard anything remotely like this so with that guys we're going to end this call i appreciate each and every one of you we love you and i'm going to unmute this so we can all say goodbye to you very much and uh I thank Thank you, Clay and Eddie. Thank you. Hey, Bobby Jane. Hey, Bobby Jane. Big ass.